Hello guys, welcome to Layman Expert and today I'm going to show you how to unlock the bootloader of Motorola devices, install TWRP recovery and root your device. Now unlocking the bootloader with factory reset your data. So make sure you back up all your data before proceeding with this method. Now first of all, download a package archive. I've posted the link in the description of the video. You can download it there. Now after downloading the file, just go ahead and extract the archive. Now a package folder will appear on your computer screen. So just quickly go ahead and open the package folder. There we'll see the folder contains a files folder, beta super user su file, which you will need later on when we will root our device and a universal ADB driver setup. First of all, just go ahead and install the universal ADB driver in your computer. Now after installing the drivers, just go to the settings menu of your phone. Scroll down to about phone. And now again scroll down. There we'll see a build number. Just go ahead and tap it seven times to unlock the developer options of your device. A message will flash, you are now a developer. Just go back to settings menu, there you will see a developer options. Just open it. Enable the OEM unlocking in developer option. Now scroll down and enable the USB debugging of your device. Now after that connect your device via micro USB to USB cable to your computer. Now go to the files folder, press shift and right click and go to option open command window here. Now in command window type ADB devices and press enter. Now a message will pop up on your phone screen. Just press OK. Now remove your device from the computer. Now go ahead and turn off your device. Now after turning off your device, press power and volume down key for 10 seconds to boot into the ADB mode. After booting into the ADB mode, just reconnect your device to the computer. Go to the command window and type fastboot oem get underscore unlock underscore data and press enter. Now you'll see uh, a string will appear on your computer, computer screen. Just go ahead and copy it and paste it into the notepad. Now remove the bootloader and stuff from the string. Now rearrange the string with no spaces.
Now after that, go to the official website of Motorola. I've posted the link in the description. So just go ahead and copy that link and paste it into the browser of your computer. Click on sign in with Google. After that, just copy the string which you have pasted in the notepad. Now just go down and paste the string and click on can my device be unlocked option. Wait for a while and now you will see a request unlock key button will appear. So just click on I agree to the terms and condition and click on request unlock key. Now go to your email account and there you will see an email from Motorola. Now the email contains the unlock code for the device. So just quickly go ahead and copy it. Now again go to the command window and type fastboot oem unlock space paste your key. Press enter. Now in my case it says failed because my bootloader is already unlocked. But in your case it will take some time. In my case it took almost 40 seconds. So it will take somewhat more or less time in your case too. So wait for a while. Now go ahead and type fast boot, reboot and enter. After that your device will reboot, you will see a warning sign and in my case it booted pretty quickly as my bootloader was already unlocked but in your case it will take quite time. Now to install the custom recovery or say TWRP recovery into your phone, you need to turn off your phone. and again go to into go into the adb mode of your phone now after unlocking the bootloader you will see that your status code of the device will change to 3 now now to install the custom recovery go to command window and type fastboot space recovery space recovery dot img press enter now the custom recovery will be installed on your phone now go into the adb mode and Press volume down button twice. There you will see a recovery mode option. Just hit the power button. Wait for a while and you will be booted into TWRP recovery. Yes. Now you are in the TWRP recovery mode of, of your device. Now to root your device, just go to the package folder and copy the beta super user SC file to your SD card or USB OTG. After that connect the SD card or your USB OTG to your phone. And go to the install option in TWRP recovery. Just go down to select storage option. There will see three types of storage, internal, micro SD and OTG. Just select where you have copied the S super user SU file. Now select the file and just swipe it to flash. 
it will take some time just wait after it will uh, after installing just uh, go to reboot system option and wait for a while Af now after rebooting just go to the menu scroll down and there you will see a super user su app which means your device is now rooted so that's it guys thanks for watching give it a thumbs up if you like our video subscribe to our channel for more videos thank you